Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and today I'm gonna make a video about a very peaceful afternoon when I am studying really hard and I hope that this video maybe motivate you to study more because mostly the scenes in this video are studying and really aesthetic so remember to study after this video so let's get started so the first thing I have to do right after taking a fat nap is to completing the rest of my essay about some human systems really complicated that I don't know so let's see the templates of this And after completing doing my essay, I suppose I have like a little bit of my time. So I decided to do an IELTS listening test, which is a test that I have to take if I want to go abroad in the USA. I just do it for fun and to practice a little bit of my listening level. And remember to watch till the end to see my score. Okay, so this is the fun part where I check my score and my result is that I made three mistakes. Um, as a result, I got 37 out of 40. 40 means uh, 8.5 in the IELTS listening exam. So my study tip number three is to always prepare every single thing in advance the night before. So you can do whatever you want to do the next day, maybe write down a to-do list with prioritizing or you can prepare all the stationery for the next day, pencils, books, textbooks, and even your laptops and iPads. This way, when you just wake up, you know exactly what you have to do and you may be not likely to procrastinate. Okay, so that day, I don't know what's going on and I don't really know what has gotten into me. I become very productive. I do an IELTS reading test, lasts me 60 minutes, but I, de I decided to quit halfway because I am so exhausted and I can't hold it anymore. So please forgive me. I just do the part one, section two and section three, I quit. So my study tip number four, which is not really related to studying, but I think it's really important and essential to do that is to drink an adequate amount of water. So my first thing whenever I prepare for studying is to drink an amount of water, maybe a glass of water or a bottle of water. Be because when you're drinking water, you will become more alert and you will like avoid being tired or exhausted when you're studying a large amount of homework or assignments so remember always put a glass of water on your desk and whenever you feel thirsty or even though you even though you don't feel thirsty but you see that uh, it's such a long time since you drank a glass of water then you can always reach to that amount of water and drink it so remember to do that And the final thing in the afternoon I do is listen to Ali Abdal. So Ali Abdal is a very well-known YouTuber talking about lifestyle, how to have a good, healthy lifestyle, and I really love his videos. So I decided to watch a lecture on YouTube about how to make a revision timetable, and that's 
really useful. I definitely recommend you guys watching this if you want to revise for an exam or something like that. Definitely check out. Alright, so that's it for today's video and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye-bye.